And now guys, let's get started here. I have here the 10 inches by 12 inches uh, plain white canvas. So I have here the colors that I'm going to use this uh, tutorial. Namely the titanium white, the cadmium yellow, the ruchina, or you can use this one, the yellow ochre. And this one is the cadmium orange, the scarlet red, tallow blue, and the black color. We're going to divide this canvas into two. The upper portion is my sky and the lower portion is my land area. Uh, get my round brush, uh, any kind of brush here because we're going to divide this into two. I'm going to use this orange color because our sky here is a warm color. So I'm going to use this orange color uh, above, above for the, above at the, uh, I'm going to make a horizontal line here above the center there I go so this is my sky and this is my uh, land area and I'm going to add also here the river then the next thing to do here is uh, I'm going to uh, paint here the sky first before the uh, land area here or the uh, subject to the lower part of this canvas so what I'm going to do here, I'm going to paint this upper portion with the warm color because it's dawn. I'm going to mix the color, this orange and the yellow, or the cadmium yellow. This lower part here, the, the orange and the yellow color. I'm going to add water to my uh, brush. The orange and the yellow. Just mix these two color. And there you go. This lower part is my... Uh, there. Then, the uh, little white here. I'm going to paint a white color at this area. At the top, this color, the orange. The orange yellow. And there you go. And just a little blend there. Just blend this color and there you are just going to this part the white color and there you go I'm going to lighten this part because the Sun is all uh, almost came out so I'm going to lighten this area and I'm going to add some yellowish color here and there you go add some yellowish there and at the top portion also just add some yellowish color or the cadmium yellow but I'm going to blend this color this is just the basic sky and there you are just paint the orange at this top or just mix first the yellow and the orange color to make uh, to create the orange yellow and there you go and just paint here and there you are I'm going to paint yellow color here and then just blend this color to the orange and there you go just blend a little here or just add white I'm going to add a white here and just blend the white color here. I'm going to add more white to this part. I'm going to lighten this area because this are the uh, area and uh, this area is the uh, uh, near to the sun. The sun here is almost uh, came out so we're going to lighten that part. Just a little blend there. And there you are. That's nice. Very nice sky. Uh, we're going to paint the orange color here at the very, very top. At the top of this color. And there you go. Just slowly going up. And just blend also the color. There you are. And there you go. There you go. That's very nice. Add water to my brush. And there you are. 
then I'm going to mix the color this orange and this scarlet red just a little scarlet red there you go I'm going to paint here directly the, the top portion this is the basic sky here so you can make this more nicer just discover your inside on your of your ta talent or just discover your talent you're an artist so you can make this very easy just there just a little blend this color and there you go there just add some red color for the clouds a little clouds there and there you go that's nice that's nice I like this and there you are going up a little just slowly there and maybe we can make this uh, it just makes this blue and red color just mix these two color to add some little white there and there you go this kind of color I think there you go just paint here at the very very corner of the right side and just I'm going to add some water and there you go that's it very nice there we're going to add some white this blue color and just paint here just paint here yes add white to this blue color just paint here and there you go and there you are that's nice very nice Just slowly go down, just blend or just add some water to your brush. Just add so that it, it can easily uh, blend the color or just make the color smooth or more smooth. Uh, mix the color red and the orange, it should be more orange. And just paint here at this, at this area so that it will blend to the, co to the other colors. And there you go that's nice very nice yeah that's it some clouds here I we're going to add some clouds dark part of the clouds there you go scattering clouds there just 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 add some clouds and there you go and there you go that's it that's it that's very nice and there you are and there so the lower part we're going to do the, to make the same with the upper part because we're going to make her the water what I did here is the same to this part because we're going to create here a big river river yeah yes continue painting with the orange color going down just going down there just there just going down just there don't worry don't worry about this area we're going to add some uh, detail this area uh, maybe we're going to add the lawn with the trees and this one also there you are then some orange color and there you go it's time to add some white here I'm going to add some white I'm going to make this and there you are I'm going to add some light color here because of this this one there this is the reflection of the sky to the water and there you go that's it that's it then some yellow color also here I'm going to add some yellow color for, for the reflection here because we have a yellow color there so we get, we'll add some yellow we'll add some yellow here and there you go that's nice very nice there let's add more yellow now we're going to lighten this part here just make some light here there you go and there you are and there that's it 
that's it that's good looking now just a little uh, blend this color here or maybe the yellow I need to add some yellow color because of this reflection there because of these clouds here a little uh, yellowish here at the top portion so we're going to make some yellow here just paint directly the yellow color or the cadmium yellow there and there you are that's nice nice and we're going to mix that again the orange and the yellow color to create the yellow orange and we're going to paint this one here there you are there you are there just blend a little here we're going to continue here at this area and there you are just add some water to my brush and just paint here and that one that's nice that's nice later we're going to add some detail with that so don't worry about this we're going to uh, paint first the sky and the water reflection the uh, reflection of the sky to the water so then the red and the orange just mix these two color again to create the red orange and just paint at least a little just add some water so you can easily uh, blend the color to the uh, canvas to the other color also and there you go just a little just slowly there going up maybe we're going to add more water to our brush and there you go and as you see there it's very nice uh, blending of colors when we add water to our brush before we're going to apply the colors so uh, here we're going to uh, create also the reflection here so the reflection of the sky this one here so I'm going to mix the color with blue and just add a little red just a little red to the blue color it should be more blue to the red we're going to add some white color this kind of color this kind of color here and now we're going to paint here we're going to add also the water so that it will uh, easily uh, blend or paint this kind this color that we mix there you go just add some water to the brush so that you can easily easily blend the color just there there you go and there you are I'm going to add more water to this color blue just mix again blue and red it should be more blue color so that it's very nice when we add also the white white color there you go this kind of color and just paint here at the very lower part there you go then after that just slowly going up just slowly going up here to make this color blend just slowly there and there you are as you see there it's very very good and some white color also add some white here and just blend I think we're going to there you go just add some white color and there you go don't worry about this later we're going to detail this part but now we're going to create the uh, very uh, base uh, layer of this part just add some white here uh, but be sure to blend this white color 
And there you go. There you are. And there you are. That's nice. And now it's time to add here the uh, land or the trees and other subject here at the uh, little center here. Uh, what I'm going to do is just uh, I'm going to mix the color this red and the blue color to create the dark color. The blue, the red or the scarlet red there. I will create here some, you know, some trees here. There, maybe this one. And going to this area, yeah, that's it. Maybe this one, there you are. Uh, we're going to paint here, cover this color, mix these two colors, just cover this one here. This is our base color of this part. And there you go. The red and the blue color. Red and the blue color. It should be balanced. It should be more blue color or more color. The blue should be more blue. And just add water to this color so that uh, we can easily add here or just can easily blend this color here. Yeah, but we're going to add some like that here because these are the trees here, a little near trees. And there you go. There you are. That one. That's nice. Very nice. There you go. There you go. And this one is my island here. I'm going to create some uh, little island to this part. And there you go. That one. This one. There you go. There you are. And there you are. That's nice. Very nice. And there. A little uh, pull down here. This num one inch uh, flat brush. I'm going to use this, the same color. Just a little pull down here. Just pull down a little. And there. And there you go. Just pull down a little here. Just a little. At the uh, far portion, it should be uh, just small amount of... Uh, just control here. Then... That one. And there you are. After that, we're going to touch with this dry brush. I'm going to touch with the dry brush. One and a half flat brush. I'm going to touch this a little here. This is the dry brush here. I'm going to use this dry brush. Just touch this one. And there you go. As you see there, it's very, very good looking. Very nice. There. So we're going to add some uh, color the trees here. So I'm going to mix this color, the Rushina and the blue color. Rushina and the blue color. It's very nice. Uh, greenish color. There. And we're going to add some here. The color the trees here. 
There you go. That's nice. Very nice. So are the color of the trees. There you go. The Russian and the blue. And just add some here. And there you go. That's nice. Then after that we have some uh, lighter color. Just add yellow to this color that we mixed earlier. The uh, Rushina and uh, blue. Just add yellow. And just add some little, uh, just a little highlight here. There. Just a little highlight to that part. Just a little. And there you are. That one. That's nice. Very nice. There you go also. That one. Add more yellow to this color, and there you are. We're going to add some Roshina and white, just uh, this color. We're going to add some here, another color, some uh, trees here, the plants or the bushes. And there you are. And there you go. In some dark color, just the black and the blue. The black and the blue color, just mix these two color. Just add here. some uh, dark portion of these grasses dark, dark portion because this area is not affected with the light so we're going to darken this area and there you go not too much but just control and there you are that's nice this one also here and there you go the next thing to do here is we're going to uh, mix the colors the blue and the red color the blue and the red color just add some white color Oops. Just add some white color this kind of color I'm going to paint here with the soil or the land here this part There you are. Let's add more white. There you go. These are my sand area. There you are. I'm using my palette knife. I'm using my palette knife there. And some a little dark 
color just mix this blue and black color just control this part with the shading the blue and the black just mix these two color I'm going to control there you go there you are the shading part of this soil the part that are not affected by the lights so we're going to add some shading the dark portion and there you go that's nice very nice I'm going to use this color I'm going to add some houses here or the roof of some house maybe I'm going to add more white there you go the roof of some house here Let's add some white color. Just the roof of the house there. And we're going to add some, the neighbor. Neighbor of this ha house. We're going to add a small house also. The roof. And this one. There you are. And there. You can make this detailed house if you you have lots of time for this, so you can make this detailed. This is only the guide for you. So I'm going to create here the small how roof roof the houses there. Let's add white. And there you are. That one. You have lots of house there. The neighbor of this the neighbors there you go We're going to cover it at uh, the house. That the house is not a, uh, it's not a, uh, a little hide. Just hide some bushes here. Maybe we're going to add some blue color. Just combine this three color: the white, the yellow, and a small amount of blue. For some bushes here, the ground to this part. And there you are. That's nice, very nice.
that one I'm going to use uh, I'm going to create here the trees to this part to this area here so what I'm going to do that one is I'm going to mix the colors blue and black color I'm going to create some dark part here dark part of this part area this area is uh, dark because it's there we're going to make here a trees to this part we're going to create now the trees using this half inch brush There you go. We're going to create here more twigs. Just push your brush and then just there. We're going to create here more twigs to this tree for the effects. there as you see there you can create more trees there easily and there you go just add more water to your brush so that you can create a lighter the thinner lines here is very nice to if you can make that one you have lots of time for this so you can create that one this is only the guide for you there you are just create more twigs here and some leaves there that's very nice going to the upper part and there you are so I'm going to get my uh, line brush or the uh, pointed brush just I'm going to use this brush here to create more twigs just add more twigs here some more detailed twigs can create this very nice if you have your line brush more thinner is more nicer uh, there you go just there and there you go here and there you go there you are more nice effect to this tree if you can create more thin lines very thin lines it look like a hair hair lines there you go. That one. And now I'm done adding this black color here, dark color. I'm done adding the twigs here, this area. So it, now I think it's time to add a little uh, lighter twigs there. I'm going to mix this ocean and uh, white. I'm going to create some uh, lighter uh, twigs there, the trunk, maybe here. Some lighter trunks there, like so there, like so. That one. And there you are. Going to create some lighter twigs, the bronzes. There you are. That one, that's very nice. You can make this more nicer. You have lots of time for this, so you can make this one more detailed.
There you are. That's that one for now. I'm going to add some uh, leaves to this, just a little leaves there. Just blue and the uh, Rushina just mix again. But we're going to add, uh, to add some uh, little leaves here. Just a little leaves. There you are. And this one, this part. And there you go. Rushina. Let's add some Rushina also. Right. It should be more Rushina. Let's paint here. There you are. That's nice. Some darker uh, leaves there at this top portion because this area is not, uh, we are about the uh, back portion of this tree. The sun is at the back of this tree so it should be a little dark there. And there you are. Just, the, just mix the blue and black color to create the shading part of these leaves or the darker leaves there maybe this one also then we're going to add some white to this color the blue and the black just add some white I'm going to paint here for the base color only there you are Later we're going to detail this part and this one. These are the grasses here to the ground. Let's add some white to this blue and black color. Later we're going to detail this part. And there you are. That's nice some dark color the blue and the dark color black There you are. The blue and the black color. Let's add some shading here. There you are. Just minimize more light color here to make this more nicer more nicer more there you are I think we're going to uh, add some grasses here using this uh, line brush the pointed brush we're going to add some grasses here more thinner lines more nicer effects so you can make more thin line here using your brass you're using your pointed brass for me I'm using this one this is only the guide for you guys so you can make this more detailed here more thin lines you can create more thin lines to this part that's nice very nice there's some grasses here More thin lines to this part. Just create some more thin lines. And 
and there you are I'm going to use some flat brush here and there you are this is only the base color so you can make more nicer you have lots of time the last of uh, time for this uh, you can make this more nicer than this I know you can do that because uh, you're an artist so just do the same just discover yourself there you go so I'm going to use this Roshina color some Roshina add some color here the grasses there I'm going to use this kind of brush there you are Rushina color let's add some here There's some grasses to the ground There you are. And that one, that's very good looking now. Very good looking ground. We're going to mix also the Rushina and the orange. I'm going to mix this color also. I'm using my flat brush number two flat brush there you are I'm going to add some more grasses here create some more grasses You have lots of time for this, so you can make this more nicer if you want. For me, it's like that. The base color. There you are. And there. I'm going to mix the color is blue and the red color. Just add white. This kind of color. This kind of color. There you are. I'm going to add to the ground from the color of my ground here and there you go yeah I can make create here the ground using this color this is only the basic ground here there you go there you are that's nice very nice that's the basic ground there so I think we're going to add more here this color and there you go in this this one here the dark color we're going to mix the, this one the blue and the black there I think there's some um, just observe my bra strokes here the blue and black color 
There we go. And there you are. That's nice, very nice. But we're going to add some, a little highlight, highlight color. Just add white to this color that we mixed earlier. And just, just make, create some, you know. There you go. Just there. And there you are. Then it's time to add also just add some dark color here. Some grasses. The blue and the black color. black color some rushina and the orange just mix this color two colors just add some here and there you go there you are there and there you go and there you are because so I'm going to add some thinner lines to that part so we're going to use this just mix the Orange, the white, and the Rushina just should be more white than the Rushina color. So it's time to add some lighter or the thin lines. It's very nice if you can make here a thin line. Rushina and the orange color. There you are. You can also use your yellow ochre. There. Add some thin lines to this grasses. It's very nice if you can create here very very thin lines. That's a very very good looking for our grasses here. There you are. Yeah. Just add water to your brush here so that you can create more thin line that's very nice if you can create here very very thin lines there you are that's very nice I will make more thin very thin line because this part is very far a little bit farther for now can make this more nicer can create this more nice uh, thin lines here there you are
that one. It's very good looking now. Then the Rushina. Rushina color. There you are. Now you have very nice grasses now. We're going to add lighter purple. We're going to add some lighter purple here, or maybe too much purple, too much light. So we're going to mix the blue and the red and just add white. We're going to control this, that color. There you are. These are the dried grasses there. And there you go. Very, very, you can make here more thin lines. You can create the one very very nice if you can make that for the sake of this tutorial I will make this kind of lines a little not too thin but uh, this is just the guide for you so that you can make this more or just develop or just create more nice And there you go. That's good looking now. And there you are. We're going to add some, you know, the, the shadow or the reflection. This, this one here, just add some reflection. I think I forget to add some reflection here that one this one here we're going to do a detail a little just add some maybe some soil here or the sand to this part we're going to add some sand here just a little sand and there you are just add some a little sand here Rushina and just add some black and blue I'll make here some sand uh, we can uh, there you are we're almost done with this painting so you can make this more nicer if you want so we're going to add some light color here some maybe some this one a uh, russian and the orange and add white so add some white there you go we're going to create here some highlight I'm going to create here some highlight and there you are highlight to the water there very nice 
it's very nice there just adds a little white just add a little white there That's very nice. This one also, we're going to add some detail with that. Because I think it's going to... We're going to add some more detail here. There, this kind of color. The orange and the rishina, just add white. The orange, it's like... It, 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 it looked like more orange. Touch with the dry brush. Just a little touch with the dry brush. And just add, just add white. It should be the dry. dry. Use the dry brush and touch the white. Oops, I think it's too much here. There you are. And that one. Then I'm going to get this kind of a color. I am going to get my palette. Because we're going to get some effects here to the water. White and orange color white and add yellow Just add white there you are this one we're going to add some this kind of effects the water using this palette knife that one a little lighter Just add white to create a more lighter color. There you are. Just touch the dry brush. And there you are. That's nice. Very nice. You can also use the thin, thin line brush for this one here. Some kind of effects.
just add water so that it can easily get here more thin lines to this part the weave effects or the highlight for the weaves there you are more lighter color to this part here I'm going to add yellow to this color the white and the yellow and add rouge in a color I'm going to add some light color here because this area just a little highlight here and this one also because this area is almost a touch with the light coming from the sun so we're going to lighten this area here This one also here. There you go. There you go. Very nice. This one. that one that's very nice just a little here and this one or maybe we're going to add more uh, sand here using this rouge in a color sand and some dark color dark color, the blue and the black color then just continue here sand Just, just experiment some color here for the the sand the soil this part then some purple the blue the red sand white this color just add more white some rushing again then some dark color the blue and bl the black there you are that's very nice part there 
lighter purple more light purple black I am going to add more white I'm going to add some here bubbles effect for the water there you go there you are that's a very nice part I think we're done with this painting. We have very, very nice painting here, guys. I hope you like this painting.